did it feel to finally put pen to paper then here at Celtic? Oh, it's a big relief, to be honest. Um, just to be a part of such a big club, um, great fans, that's what I wanted to have since um, the, the summer started, really. So, um, and when Celtics called and said they wanted me at their club, I just ran over. <laughs> You've been training with the club for a number of weeks now. Has there been any kind of reason why this deal hasn't happened sooner? Um, well, I had to, um, like it was a mutual thing. They had to see what I'm about. Um, I had to see what the club about, the club's about as well, obviously. And uh, if I like, because it's my first time living out of London. Um, <laughs> I haven't been anywhere above Watford Gap. So um, it's been a bit hard for me to try and adjust when I've been anywhere like I went to Aston Villa on loan, it was a bit hard. Um, but I've been up here alone um, for the last two, three weeks and uh, I've settled in really well. The people of Glasgow City are, uh, are really welcoming and um, I've had just a great rapport with people. Did you have offers from any other clubs? Is there anyone else showing some interest in you in the last couple of weeks? Um, yeah, of course, uh, like it always usually is. But um, I've been at the club, I, I, I showed my commitment when I got injured, I showed my commitment that I wanted to stay here and I know you can't really sign an injured player but um, the club um, accommodated me well and uh, I just felt this is the best place for me to be. Lee Griffiths is in, in top form for Celtic at the moment, how do you see yourself fitting into the, the Celtic starting eleven? Well um, I'm a different player to, to Lee, um, he's, a nice, he's a good nice nip, nippy player scores goals left, right and centre um, and uh, I see myself a bit more of a powerhouse, um, occupying two or three defenders, getting on the end of crosses and um, that's what I see myself as, um, trying to break open defences when they're really tight and locked. What has Ronnie Dyla said to you about this move? Um, obviously he's wanted me to be here um, and I'm, I, he knows it's a big move for me, moving away from my family and um, moving into another country, obviously. Um, but I see it as a great opportunity for me to be at such a big club and be with big fans. Everyone at the, the staff as well have been brilliant <coughs> towards me. And uh, I just felt so welcome. So um, I, that's why I wanted to get this deal done and over the line so I could start working. Are you ready to fit in straight away? Of course, I already fitted in. Go and ask the players. You know what I mean? like they, they've taken, um, taken to me well, I've taken to them and I've um, in the change room, is a great um, atmosphere and I just wanted to be a part of that. Carlton could have undoubtedly had more money, England, America and Middle East. What is it about Celtic that's made you come here when you could have perhaps made a better amount of money elsewhere? Um, being at Celtic is not about the money, is it? It's about wearing the shirt with pride. Um, the same I had at West Ham. If you put on a shirt um, at West Ham and you wear it with pride, um, the fans will take to you and you'll get a good, a good um, rapport with the fans and that's what I, I'm here for and I can see the same sort of thing at Celtic and um, I've had everyone, as soon as I've come here I've had everyone explain to me, even up to the, the, to the taxi man, uh, <laughs> telling me that he's, how much the club means to them and uh, that's what I wanted to hear and uh, I want to I wanna hopefully be a hero to some. Was the op opportunity to maybe win some trophies and add that to your career? Was that one of the reasons? Of course, <laughs> of course. Uh, you, that's that's one thing you cannot forget. That um, sort of kind of great position to win trophies going forward, um, and I I wanted to add that to my career. And um, well, it's a family club as well. That's one thing that you can't forget. Everybody connected to the club, connected to the club, really wants the club to do well. And if you got a family club like this that goes and wins things, we can all win together and be happy to go. Was Bolton one of the clubs that you might have had an opportunity to go to? I haven't. I, I didn't really talk about Bolton, but I'm here to talk about Celtic really. But um, this is this is all I'm here for, and uh, obviously get clubs that are interested in in, in players like me, on um, a free agent, and um, Celtic was just a no-brainer for me. Did you take advice from any perhaps former players, former Celtic players before coming to Celtic and? No, I don't really need advice. Um, you already know from from down south. You know how how big Celtic are as a club. We're all around the world. I go to uh, anywhere in the world. Go to New York. You see, you see Celtic fans go across to Australia. You see Celtic fans. So it doesn't really matter. You know how big the club is. So I didn't have to take any advice really. Carlton, there's always an issue with players about the length of their contract. Your deal with Celtic is there an option between you or the club to opt out after the first year? Um. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think there is. Um, that's obviously between me and the club, and I don't. 
I, I wouldn't discuss that here. And you're fit to play for Celtic now? Are you still pushing towards that? Yeah, I'm, I'm pushing towards um, to gain full fitness so I can play as soon as possible, really. Have you had a chance to witness what it's like in a Champions League night here at Celtic Park? Pardon, say that. Have you had a chance to witness what it's like? Yeah, yeah, I have. Um, uh, the Fenerbahce game was a, a massive game, obviously, and um, that's the first <laughs> first I've seen it roaring, you know. And um, you see the fans, the passion, and they're 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 they're, they're twelfth man, really. So that's what um, the club's about, and that's why I really wanted to sign here and 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 play underneath and underneath those lights in the European games as well. It'd be a, it's a great bonus for me.